everybody. I hope um, you're having a good week so far. I can't believe we're already at Thursday. It's going flying by really fast, actually. Um, I'm really enjoying working from home and um, yeah, I finished for the afternoon and um, thought I'd check in with you guys. Um, this is just a short floss tube episode. I just wanted to update you on where I'm at with Lucy Calcutt, 1825. That's the only one I've been solidly working on. Um, so last week when I, um, well, the week before when I did my floss tube episode, I'd finished this motif with the birdie. And now I've completed the basket of flowers. I think I could have started this flower when I had the episode. Um, but I've finished that now. I just love it. It's really pretty. I just, oh, these are so gorgeous. Um, and then this looks like something you'd use, you know, the sieve or whatever it's called for harvesting um, hay or whatever. And then I've started on the date, so 1825, and the young lady, Lucy, was um, age eight. So I've got up to there. And then next thing is to finish off the word age. And there's a swan around about here. So I'll do that next probably. Um, yeah, so that's where I'm at at the moment. It's looking really good. I'm really loving it. So I'll just pause this and I'll show you the fabric that came in this week that I bought online from Jay's Cross Stitch and Journey of a Stitcher. Um, it's gorgeous fabric. Hey, so we've got... Autumn at Hawk Run Hollow. I really, really, really can't wait to start this. I need to get the DMC for it. Um, oh, I just love all those autumn colours. And then, don't mind the mess there on the table. And then um, I got this from Jay's Cross Stitch 32 Count um, Linen. And it's, I think, bush tea or... Yeah, I think it's a bush tea. And I just love the variations in colour in that one. Just gorgeous. So that's that one. Next, um, Wayne's just walking past. Next, we have the fabric for um, A Gentleman's Daughter by Plum Street Samplers. This one had a blue gray background. Um, I've chosen Mulberries from J Jay's Cross Stitch, 36 count uh, linen. It's gorgeous. Really pretty. I think that'll complement it nicely because there's a lot of reds in here, but they're distinct enough that they'll not be lost in the fabric. Um, the next one I have is um, Scarlet House, and it's the American Farmhouse. How cute are the quilts? So adorable. And I got um, 32 count Stormy Night in Zweigart, Belfast from um, Journey of a Cross journey of a stitcher and it's 13 inches by 18 inches next we have um, the scarlet house and it's a perfect world and i got from journey of a stitcher um 13 inches by 18 inches um 40 count platinum Zweigart newcastle and it's gorgeous it will take a bit of getting used to because it's a lot smaller than the 36 count but um I think that'll be fine. It's a really lovely neutral. Love it. But not least, um, we've got Winter Cottage Victoria Sampler. And this one, I got a really lovely fabric. It's uh, Blue Whisper and it's 32 count, 13 by 18 inches linen um, from Journey of a Sti Stitcher. So that's the fabric I've got. It's like clouds. It's sort of got lighter blue and like almost white it's just lighter patches of blue and darker blue really pretty and this one's fully kitted up because it came the chart came with the threads and the buttons so that's all folks whatever you're doing i hope you're well and safe and i hope you're getting lots of stitching in